Hello friends. Well, we had a special day yesterday. Getting ready for coming hurricane. Category 5. Then category 4. Then just 3. Now just 2. Who knows, hopefully by the time it's gonna come here, it'll be just a storm with lots of rain. But one never knows. So all the potted plants we put off the stands onto the ground. Everywhere. Here and there. The ones that had a recent root cut under the roof. It was a big job to put it everything down and later on up it goes again. More and more. And more and more. I don't want to bore you by showing everything. Anyway, just some of it went to the ground here and elsewhere. But uh, the seedlings with perlites in, in perlite trays, they would just fly away in a hurricane, so they had to go inside and also the plants that had a hand cross-pollinated seed pods had to go inside. Well, I'll show you still more here. You see the empty tables, it's all on the ground. Getting ready for possible coming of a hurricane. Next to the tables and under the tables. And as I said, there is more in the house. The seedlings in perlite and uh, plants with seed pots. The outdoor aquariums are gone too because the flying branches can break them. The fishes are inside the empty aquariums. Trace with seedlings. Plants. with uh, seed pots Hello Dorset Horn How are you doing? This is my oldest but never witnessed such thing Bottles with water ready because we might not have electricity, phone, internet, and water connected for a while. That's what happened last two times we had a hurricane. And here is the bathroom, here is the shower. Serving as a Hurricane shelter. Seat pot and a rare stuff. Adeniums. 
draw din yung sokotranong and grafted adenium or set horn morsera cuttings and last and last but not least dam one of the plants is cracking the seed pot the other half is also cracking but less we have more seeds coming poor fishes have to wait for the hurricane emergency to pass I was afraid that the branches flying might break the aquarium so I had to empty the outdoor aquariums and drag them here bring them here super heavy and my fishy fishies are no longer guarding the front of the house they're waiting in a bottle in a gallon bottle if this plant would be outside and the seed pot cracks like this or even just like this I'll disconnect the seed pot from a plant and put it inside in a paper bag to dry and open fearing that outside it might open in a blasting sun and seeds might fly away but now that I had to bring the plant inside because of a hurricane warning well there is no wind here the seed pot can be slowly opening at its own speed to its heart desire and maybe I'll record the progress well 24 hours passed this one opened a little bit and this one opened a lot it could have opened more if it wouldn't be so drizzly and if it'll be warmer tomorrow I might record further progress day three indoors day four another day a little more progress some seeds are separating already starting okay and now I better gather these seeds take them away because they might start falling on the floor 